Hey guys, Annie McCarty here again. I wanted to talk for a few minutes about the Insanity series. So I have done both Insanity and I have done most of Insanity Max 30. Um, I have not done the Asylum series, so unfortunately I cannot give you feedback on those two workouts in the Insanity um, titles, but the other two I will give you a quick review on. So Insanity was the second beach body workout that I tried and I will just give you a little heads up right off the bat. I am not really a cardio person. Um, I do not just go run on the treadmill. Um, cardio is not my strong point. It's something that I've really worked on, but it's not, it's not my preferred method of working out. So insanity is definitely hard. Um, I'm not going to lie and sugarcoat it and tell you that you're going to love every second. Um, I think the first, you know, couple weeks that I did it, I literally thought I was going to die in just the warm up alone, but I was also extremely out of shape at this point. Um, you know, the original insanity is probably something that I would not recommend to a beginner. Um, at the time it was one of the, you know, one of the few workouts that Beachbody had. So that was part of why I chose it and it was brand new. So I wanted to check it out. Um, but now there are a lot of other programs that are definitely better designed for beginners. And I think that you'll get um, less discouraged choosing one of those. But if you are a runner, if you really like endurance workouts, um, or endurance training kind of stuff, or you just love your cardio, you like getting your heart rate up and just going crazy on a workout, this is definitely the workout for you. Um, most of the, pro the workouts are, um, I believe you start at like 30 or 40 minutes and then the second month, it's a 60 day program, the second month they go up to about an hour. So these are longer workouts, um, but you will be going the entire time. Um, it is basically nonstop, you do get breaks, but you know, you are doing all kinds of complex moves to get your heart rate up, um, get those calories burning and then also to build muscles at the same time. So, you know, you're going to be doing some push-ups and squats and, you know, all kinds of stuff like that in there while you're also doing cardio. Um, definitely fast paced and definitely, like I said, not really for the beginner, but you can get absolutely crazy results from this program. Then there's Insanity Max 30, um, which just came out recently, and I I only did it while I was pregnant, so I will preface that. Um, I was following the modifier for a lot of it. Um, the modifier in this program is amazing. That was one of the things that I really loved about this program because if you're not ready to go up to the full workout, you can follow the modifier and be great. You're still doing the workout. You shouldn't feel bad about following the modifier. You can still get great results. Um, and one of my other favorite things about the modifier in this program is if you choose to play the modifier track, you will have the video of all the people doing, you know, doing the regular workout. Um, you know, the normal workout video, but then there is a camera on the modifier the entire time up on your screen. So you can really see what they're doing. That's one of my gripes with a lot of other workouts is if you're trying to follow the modifier because you're not in perfect shape yet, or you just don't, you know, you can't quite do all the full moves. Sometimes you can't really see what they're doing. And this program completely solved that. Um, it is all 30 minute workouts. It is based on um, interval training again. It definitely is gonna push you. You are gonna sweat, it is gonna be hard, 
But part of the premise of this, which is what I think I really like about it, is that you're supposed to fail. Um, you are supposed to find that point where you cannot keep going anymore. And if you don't find that point in the 30 minutes, um, especially if you are just starting the program, you're probably not pushing yourself hard enough. Um, what maxing out is, is where the name comes from, Insanity Max 30, is basically finding that time, that minute of the workout where you just cannot go any further and you need to take a break. And you want to be failing. You want to find that point because that means that you have pushed yourself and you are getting a good hard workout, which means you are going to get results. Uh, one of the other things I really like about the, the Max program, Insanity Max 30, is that there's a lot of cardio, but he also has a lot of um, muscle building days built in as well, the Tabata days. So um, you are, it's all body weight exercises. You don't need any extra equipment, but you are doing push-ups and tricep dips and squats and all kinds of stuff to help tone and build your muscles. Um, this is one that I am super excited to do once my baby arrives and I am getting back into shape. I think that I'm going to get just absolutely insane results from it, um, especially based on the results that I got while I was following the modifier. But, you know, this is one where if you are a total beginner, it might be a little bit challenging. Um, you know, you're, you're going to have to really dig deep and push yourself through the workout, but it's not to say that you can't do it. Um, you know, just follow that modifier and keep going. And if you are a triathlete or marathon runner and want an awesome program to cross train with, a crossfitter, this is perfect for you. It is going to be right up your alley and the kind of workout that you really enjoy doing. So I think that everybody should check this program out because it's a really good one. Thanks guys.